Back with W96 back here for another video for y'all today. Today we're just going to be talking. Um, first I'm going to update you on the work, the work schedule, and then we're going to go into a little rant. I'm going to try to be nice about it, but I'm going to go into a rant. Because I'm at the point where I just don't care anymore and I'm tired of fucking fighting it. I'm tired of holding it back. I'm tired of even trying. And I'm sorry I haven't posted in like six days, but I've been really busy. I've been really busy since last week, and so I haven't had time to do a video. I'm off today, that's why I'm doing the video. But yesterday I bought uh, two cans of Grizzly, because I knew eventually I was going to run out, and I needed to buy some. This hat's too tight on my head, but I don't care. Anyway, I needed to buy dip, and I wanted to make sure I bought Grizzly, because if not, I'm going to have to buy a roll on Friday, and I don't have a coupon for it. So I got one can, a dollar off, and then another can I paid full price. Um, so I think it was like five eighty five for the one can, and then I got um, then I got um, I paid four eighty five because it was a dollar off, and then uh, the second can was five eighty five, and I paid the full price because I don't really care, but I ain't paying five eighty five anymore. If I can keep going to Fast Mart and getting dip and having a dollar off plus a dollar off in that in that motherfucker, I'm going to. But anyway, s wait, yeah, no, today's November 1st. Okay, so if you got your dip, go your dip. If you got your chew, go your chew. If you don't dip, thumbs up. Do you think for coming back to the channel? I know some of y'all don't dip, and that's all right by me. Told y'all about Grizzly. <coughs> Excuse me. I've been drinking on Pepsi. I've been on and off and sleep all day uh, since like 7.30 this morning. I've been tired as heck. So I've just been sleeping because I'd rather catch up on my sleep than go into work dead tired, but still. Mm. Trying to see which side is raw as heck because whatever side is really raw, I won't dip on that side. My left is really raw, but I'm just going to say screw it. Ain't that bad a bitch. Look, a fucking stem. I don't want that shit on my dip. Anyway. So, I got my work schedule yesterday, and... Thir Thursday, I worked 2 to 9. Friday, 8 to 2. Saturday, 2 to close. Sunday, 9 to 1. Yeah, they got me on some weird stuff. I'm off Tuesday, Wednesday, and Monday. So, hopefully this time, this day, these, the, at least the two night shifts go fast. Because if they go fast, that's good. If they go slow... Who matter, what matters, because I get paid anyway for it, so. Alright, so. I've been holding this back for a couple, uh, since yesterday. I was going to do a video yesterday, but I ended up going out with my mama. My mom and them. Because I knew I could get dipped one way or another, figure something out, walk somewhere, do something. So I went out with them. So, around... Well, and I also bought beer, but that's beside my point. My point is, um, I think we got back here around um, 8.30-ish. It was like 8.20, 8.30. I didn't start drinking until 9.30. Well, no, it was like 10. No, it was like 9.45-ish. And normally I drink at like 10.45 or 11. But that's beside my point. The point is, Drama started, and the girl that I was getting really serious about accused me of something, so I accused her of something that's paid back as a motherfucker. She was trying to say that I was doing something bad because she went through my Facebook messages when I told her not to, and she did it anyway. And see, well, this is what pisses me off the most, is when you sit there and lie to me. 
multiple times and then expecting me to buy you stuff like no why am i gonna use my good heart good heart and my money to buy you stuff that you want that i'm trying to be nice about and buy you and then you turn around and accuse me of something for all I know, you you wasn't messing with another dude where you live. You wasn't fucking talking to another dude where you live. So technically speaking, yes, I'm accusing you of cheating because I don't fucking care. Accuse me of something, I'm going to accuse you of something. <laughs> just, that's the way it works with me. 50-50. So that, let, let that be known now that I was seriously talking to somebody... But after a week and nine days, it fucking didn't work out too good. And I don't care if she sees this because guess what? Like my dad used to say, Donald Duck don't give a fuck. This is the problem with people. If I have enough trust in you, I'm going to give you my fucking information. What she just did, what she did recently, and then I changed my password, just put, tells, just tells me that I could, I shouldn't have trusted her in the first place. I shouldn't have wasted my almost my whole last check on her. I could have bought me my laptop. I could have put money away for the PlayStation. I could have put money away for the car. I could have done a lot of freaking stuff. And what happened? She did what I told her not to do. And she did it anyway. So the way I look at it, she lied to me. She used me. She used me for money. And she lied about, oh, I do love you. No, the fuck you didn't. Because if you did, you wouldn't fucking sit there and accuse me of shit. Yeah, I talked to girls. Yes, I call them beautiful. But that don't mean accuse me of cheating. Because technically speaking... If they have a boyfriend and they're having a bad day, I'm going to cheer them up one way or a fucking other. Most of all of y'all know that. Y'all all know me well enough to know that's how I am. That's how I was raised. And to be fair, if you can't respect how I was raised, then don't fucking talk to me. Don't waste my fucking time. And here's another thing that I wanted to speak of on her. Because I'm not naming any names. I'm just naming, I'm just saying her. She has a daughter, which is completely understandable. But the problem I have with it is I was going to bust my butt to help her, but not only help her, but help myself. And what do I get in return? A FaceTime every other day. Uh, a phone call probably one time every other day, if that. So the way I look at it, she was doing stuff behind my back, even though she said, I don't feel good. I, I, I was sleeping. I took a nap. It's obvious to me she was talking to somebody behind my back. I don't play, I don't play like that. And I'm starting to go back on the, I don't play with others too, too well. Because I can't keep doing this. I can't, I can't keep being nice. I'm going to start, I'm going to start just saying no, no to everybody that asked me for money. Like, no, go, go get a job. Wait until you get paid. I'm not helping you. I'm not going to waste my fucking money on y'all. Unless it's very necessary, like a dip review or something. Or am I, if I'm sending you money to send me dip, I haven't even tried. Like Rooster, for example. Or if y'all can find Timber Fine Cut Wintergreen, and y'all want to send me a can, I'll send you the money to buy me a can and send it to me. That's the only way I would give anybody any money. As if I was getting something in return. But I get paid on Friday. Which I work 8 to 2. 
uh, Saturday, uh, Thursday, Thursday, Saturday, Thursday and Saturday are the only two days that are going to suck because I work at night. But I'm okay with night because by the time I get home, and I realized this before I even drink beer, on night shift, I get very tired. So, I'll try to have a video up within a few days. Um, go on my second channel and you will find a voting thing in the community. Go vote. Let me know what y'all want to see for my second channel for the month. I'm, I'm going to start doing one month to one Pacific game. Like last month was somewhat Call of Duty for most of the month. And a little bit of Madden. So, yeah. If y'all want to see more of that, just go on my second channel and, um, Vote and let me know. Um, if you ain't dipping your trunk, you can get back. I would just see on the dip side. So positive, always think positive, never think negative. And things will come your way. Always think it's the positive and positive things will come in your heart and in your mind. I hope you have a great day, great night, wherever you're watching this. And I will see you. I'll see you on the dip side. America.